Hey guys, so tonight's recording goes out to all of you who are feeling positively lonely and forgotten and comfortless and you have tried everything that you can think of to comfort yourself. You've turned to things that are not good for you. You have turned to things that bring you instant pleasure and um, things that over the long haul desensitize you, desensitize all of us to, to things that are simply not going to lead us to life. So I pray that you will find comfort in these words, and I know you will because it's my Father's word, and he honors his word above all things. And he watches over his word and he's careful to perform it. So I just thank you, Father, that you have given me a voice. You've given me a heart to speak to your people and to speak to those who are far and to speak to those who are near and to share your heart and your mind for them. I thank you that you are not a dead God, that you are not an impotent God that your arms are not short. I thank you that you are on the throne of this existence, regardless of what our enemies try to convey to us through our, through our thought life or feelings and emotions and mind pictures and through others and their own shortcomings. And Father, I just thank you that we war not against flesh and blood according to your word. I thank you that you are faithful and that you are loving. You are worthy of all honor and glory. And the word says in John chapter 14, verse 15, If you love me, keep my commandments, and I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter, that he may abide with you forever. Even the Spirit of truth, whom the world cannot receive, because it seeth him not, neither knoweth him. But ye know him, for he dwelleth with you, and shall be in you. I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. But Father, I thank you that this is your word, and it is true. And that all of those listening to my voice tonight will close their eyes in the comfort of your heart, your mind, your word, your spirit. In Jesus Christ's name I pray. And I love you. And I love you who's listening.